Hello and welcome to this episode of Product of the Week. I'm your host and educator, Robin Mitchell. In today's episode, we will be looking at, thank you, Richard, the Arduino Alvic, a complete robotic kit that will surely let your creativity go wild all while learning about hardware, software, and the fundamentals of robotics. The Arduino Alvic is a complete kit that lets you build a tiny wheeled robot powered by an Arduino Nano ESP32, which in my opinion is the best Nano board. Well, because the ESP32 is an absolute beast. With the ability to allow for customization and the support for multiple Nano boards, the Arduino Alvic is definitely the solution for those who are looking to build their first Arduino projects or better for those looking to teach. Now, you may be thinking, Robin, there are plenty of robotic kits on the market. How is this one any different? Well, I'm glad that you're probably thinking that because I have the answer for you. To start, because this kit is highly customizable, you can make your own robotic platform work with various sensors, allowing for all kinds of unique environmental behavior, such as following a line or moving towards a heat source. Furthermore, because the kit itself is in parts, you get to build this thing from the ground up, meaning that you can get some decent hands-on experience when it comes to making robotic systems. However, what I really love about this kit is the use of Lego connector holes on the side. Not too sure what you would call them, but because of these holes, you can create much larger designs using a combination of Lego and electronics. For an excellent example of combining electronics with Lego, check out our Lego Planetarium video. So for example, you could make a mini bulldozer, a movable crane, or even an automated cookie smasher whose prime goal is to smash the dreams of small children. Starting with the frame itself, not only does it support Lego connectors, it also has numerous M3 screw holes, which allow for custom parts to be attached. And even better, the frame itself is compatible with 3D printing and laser cutting, allowing for all kinds of unusual alterations. This kit also incorporates a number of various internal mechanical and electrical parts, including rubber wheels, motors, time of flight distance and line following sensors, and an internal battery so that the robot can move independently from a power source. Furthermore, the Arduino Alvic also supports Grove sensors, meaning that adding extra Grove sensors is trivial. Instead of trying to fit around with individual wires inserted into pin headers, Grove sensors can just be plugged straight in. So even someone like me who struggles to do the most basic things can get it done. Finally, the Arduino Alvic also has quick connectors and an additional STM32 ARM Cortex-M4 microcontroller integrated into the motherboard, allowing for numerous powerful capabilities. For a kit like the Arduino Alvic, the sky is the limit. No, no, really, the sky is the literal limit because you could actually attach this thing to a weather balloon simply because. Whatever you want your robot to do, I am fairly certain it can be done with the Arduino Alvic. But holding a soldering iron to my hand forced me to come up with three projects. Well, the first one would undoubtedly be a line following robot. However, I would want to add a bit of interest. So I would instead make a line following robot that has to avoid obstacles. Furthermore, that robot could then map out the track and then determine the shortest route, making it a clever bot. The second project that I would pick would be a sumo bot for robot, well, oh, oh, sorry, a uh, potential copyright claim there, uh, Battle of Attrition Robot Competition, also known as Bark. Simply put, the battle bots could be made using the Arduino Alvic and pitted against each other in a coliseum while us humans lie down eating grapes and dormice, laughing at the suffering of the bots as they smash each other to pieces. A third project idea would be something like a miniature logistics hub, something that could allow robots to deliver goods from one place to another. Of course, the small size of these bots wouldn't allow for any serious cargo, but they could certainly be used in an educational environment to teach the challenges of industrial and warehouse logistics and how bots can be used to solve these issues. 
The Arduino Alvic has a ton of potential, and the use of multiple peripheral expansion ports, the use of M3 and LEGO connectors, and the inclusion of the Arduino Nano ESP32 means that there's almost nothing that this kit can't do with the exception of uh, filing HMRC taxes, which I am legit overdue on because I am a workaholic who has terrible organization skills. But really, what makes this kit truly wonderful is that it was designed to empower your inner creativity so that you can learn about robotics, electronics, and software in a way that best suits you. If you like what we do here at Electromaker and want to support our efforts, then hit the like button, smash the subscribe button, ding that channel alert, and head over to the Electromaker store where you can get this and many other parts for your weird and wonderful projects. This is Robin Mitchell, signing off.